So the final race of the week is the Montpellier Cup. It's a listed chase. I'm not quite sure why this one's been added in at the end. It's a two miler. I've got quite a few of them already this week. Final wraps of the Paul Rhodes at the top. High Town for Darren Thompson. Jack Sparrow, Ryan Tamasemi. Lock and Kai for Graham Clutterbuck. Tamia Londis for Ryan Costello has also got the great grey. Ring a ring of roses for Martin Leedham. Scarlet Perky for James Shea. The magician Joshua Sutherland. And yes, Hollywood for Derek Hinton. Ten of them then. In this 39th and final race of the week, and away they go. And racing down towards the first, and a bit of a mistake there by Jack Sparrow, gave it a bit of a wallop, and got away with it. And Ring of Ring of Roses and Scarlet Perky are going to dispute the lead as so they make their way towards the second of the nine. We lock and Kai back in third, and then Jack Sparrow fourth, recover from that mistake as they get to the second, which they're all safely over. And Ring of Ring of Roses in front from Scarlet Perky. Jack Sparrow and Lock and Kite with the Magician and Fire Rhapsody. They the the grey over on the far side there, Fire Rhapsody. The other one is the Great Great. And then Derek Hinton's pink jacketed Yes Hollywood is after that one. And then the back two are High Town and Tammy's along this one cost. That seems to have two horses in just about every race at the moment. And it's Ring and Ring of Roses in the lead. And Scarlet Perky. Then Jack Sparrow and Lock and Kite. Yeah, the Magician. Fire Rhapsody, the Great Great, Yes Hollywood, and then at the back High Town, and finally Tammy's Alondis. So they're already down to the final mile and a quarter almost then. And Ring a Ring of Roses and Scarlet Perky not hanging a bed. With Jack Sparrow took behind them in third, then the Magician is fourth, Lock and Kai is after that one, and the Great Grey trying to get into it as well. So too is Yes Hollywood for Hollywood Hinton as they take the fifth and a really good jump there by Jack Sparrow has seen it join the leading pair of Scarlet Perky in the green and Ring a Ring of Roses in the purple and white stripes as they make their way down towards the next end. They're coming down towards the final mile of this Montpellier chase and Scarlet Perky is just about in the lead as they come to the sixth. This is going to leave them with three more to take but now it's Ring a Ring of Roses that's gone back on again. Jack Sparrow in second. Scarlet Perky is third. The Magician getting closer. So too's the Grey Grey. So's Lock and Kai. He races on in earnest now. Yes, Hollywood and Fire Rhapsody there as well. High Town has still got a bit of work to do. Tammy's along. This is the only one totally out of it. But Jack Sparrow's gone into the lead from Ring a Ring of Roses in second. Then in third, Scarlet Perky. The Magician is next. The Great Grey trying to run on. Fire Rhapsody's been pulled round the outside as they're coming down towards the third last now. Then Jack Sparrow landed in front. Ring a Ring of Roses second. And Scarlet Perky, the Magician, the Great Grey, then yes, Hollywood and Fire Rhapsody, Lock and King under a bit of pressure. High Town's got a lot of work to do, difficult to see it winning from there, but it's Jack Sparrow that's in the lead. Then Ring of Ring of Roses dropped tamely away, and that one's beaten. It's Jack Sparrow from the Magician. The Magician jumped it best and landed in the lead. The Magician races away in front. The Magician is now half a length up on Jack Sparrow in second, Fire Rhapsody third. Then yes, Hollywood surely between these. The Great Grey though might have something to say about that one as that starts to sweep round the outside and look at this high town absolutely flying as they get over the final fence and it's the magician in the lead from Jack Sparrow the great great trying to run on the magician's in front Joshua Sutherland's had a great week he started it really well can they end it really well as well they've got a really really long run in there's still a furlong and a half to go and it's the magician from Jack Sparrow it's between these two nothing else can win it the magician looks to be strongest at the moment Jack Sparrow's got nothing left the magician has now started to pull away and the magician pulls another the rabbit out of the hat and suddenly finds himself four, five, six lengths clear and an easy win in the end. The magician takes it. Jack Sparrow second, the great grey third, then Scarlet Perkin, yes, Hollywood and High Tan. And the field trails all the way back to Tamiza Londis. And that is your final race of week five. And the magician takes it for Joshua Sutherland. He took the first one and he's took the last one. And he's definitely definitely staking a claim this week to regain that champion trainer's crown the magician for Joshua Sutherland the winner Jack Sparrow Ryan Tamasevi second Great Grey Ryan Costello third Scarlet Perky for James Shepard's fourth and yes Hollywood for Derek Hinton was fifth